What's good, MABW team? What's going on today, MABW fam? I'm back today with another video to my audience out there. I want to get your opinion on this because, as you know, Jim Jones was talking to Chrissy Lampkin about possibly getting married now. But I'm pretty sure a lot of you women know, because y'all pay attention to that show, uh, Love and Hip Hop, a lot, that Chrissy Lampkin has been trying to marry Jim Jones for years, and he has always declined. There was a time when she even got on her knee to, to propose to Jim Jones. And even though he even though she proposed to him, they still never had a marriage. Now, in some ways, I can agree with Chrissy. Like, Jim Jones waited way too long. And unfortunately, I feel like for men, if you don't want to be married, just don't even accept the ring from the woman. Don't string her along. And don't make it even seem like, <clears throat> don't even make it seem like there ever would even be a possibility of you getting married. I think she does love Jim Jones, but I think that it's just the fact that he's he's finally doing it now on his time, if y'all can understand what I'm saying. And mind you, she's 51 and Jim is like 44, 45, I believe. So he's been basically putting marriage off for like over 10 years and he's been with her even longer than that i believe she's 51 so to the woman out there if you wanted to marry a man at a certain you know within a certain time what would you feel the time should be do you feel like it should be within three years five years or whenever he's ready because of course a lot of you women are um, ready sooner than men. And with Jim Jones being a superstar back then, I mean, I could kind of understand why he wouldn't want to marry her too at that time, because it's like, he he probably, he probably probably knew the possibility of him stepping out and he didn't want to risk having to do something like that and losing anything. If y'all can understand what I'm saying, like why marry her if you know you're going to be touring and possibly messing around with other um, women and you're married. I mean, the, to the women out there, I, I mean, I personally, I personally don't know, but does it make it worse if you're married and you cheat or does it even matter at all? Like if he, if, if it's just his girlfriend, would it be worse or would it be worse if he was married to her because he's violating like that oath that they took up under God. If y'all can understand what I'm saying, like, and I mean, maybe he would have had way more regrets knowing he was a married man doing that instead of that just being his girlfriend. Because some guys think like that. Some guys think that it's worse to cheat on the woman that they're with when they're married. And they think that when it's their girlfriend, it's not as bad. It doesn't cut that deep. Like it doesn't cut that deep. And also, you know what my thoughts is also? I don't know how financially stable Chrissy Lampkin is, but I believe that if she was really well off and a pretty successful woman, I believe she probably would have ditched Jim Jones probably a few years back. I believe she would have definitely ditched him a few years back, but I, I don't think monet, uh, monetarily wise, I don't think Chris Lampkin, Chrissy Lampkin really, uh, has that type of income where she can leave Jim Jones. And unfortunately it's like that sometimes for women. They're so used to that man's that they're so used to that man taking care of everything that they forgot about their own goals and they just stuck it out with that man, hoping that that man would one day marry them. That's how a lot of women are. And it's just unfortunate now that, you know, she just like, you know what? It's just been so long that it's not even worth it. You know, I don't wait it this long and I don't even want to do that. And to the woman out there, what do y'all think the reason for her not wanting to marry him now actually is? Because, I mean, y'all the y'all are the experts out there on this type of stuff. Why would y'all think that she wouldn't want to marry him now when she wanted to marry him, wanted to marry him for so many years and a long time ago? Now it's like, it's just whatever. It's not even worth it. 
Is it a possibility that she could be dealing with somebody else? I mean, sometimes it can get like that. Sometimes women can be like, yo, you waited so long. Now you want to marry me and I don't even want to give my time to you anymore as far as marriage wise, because I, I want to deal with somebody on the side. I mean, is it a possibility? I'm just throwing that out there. Is it a possibility? I don't know. I mean, Jim Jones played too many games. He's a grown ass man. If you wanted to marry her, you should have married her back then. You can't come crying now because you washed up. Talk about you want to get married because that happens too. Those men's career start fading off into the background and they're not superstars like they used to be. And then that's when they want to settle down. They've done everything they wanted to do. There's nothing left for Jim Jones to, to do. Unfortunately, Dipset is washed up. We just got to be real here. They're not superstars like they used to be. They're not. So it, it, it could go various ways on this. It could just be various uh, variables that are that are that are the reason why Chrissy Lampkin doesn't want to marry Jim Jones. I mean, like I said, if any ladies, any, if any of you ladies out there know, y'all let me know in the comment section why she doesn't possibly want to marry Jim Jones anymore, and why she thinks it's just a pretty much it's up now, just a waste of time. Anyways, that's my video for today. If you like the video, of course, comment, like, and subscribe. It ain't costing you a damn thing. And of course, I'm going to holler back at y'all later. Peace.